Boss monsters. We love these bad boys. Whether it's for resources or speed ups, refined stones, some other items, we spend a lot of time on a daily basis killing these things. And they can be great. But sometimes, these boss monsters can be a real pain in the backside to kill. So here, we're gonna go over one particular tip that could make it a bit easier for you to kill these monsters. Hi, you're welcome to Red Ebony. My name is Yasha, Aka Yasha. So, when it comes to boss monsters, there are a lot of things that you can do to improve your effectiveness in killing these things. You can work on the buffs that you're using. You can work on your march size. You can work on the type of troops that you're using, using higher level troops and even more troops. You could work on your general, improve your general, gear, refine, specialties. There's a lot of stuff that you can do. But this particular tip that we're about to go through should make it a bit easier for you to kill those boss monsters on a regular basis. Before we go into that though, I'd like to let you guys know that the Aptoid codes are now live. The codes are available for a limited period of time. And if you use the code on the screen, AKA007, you can get additional discounts when you're making purchases with Aptoid. The channel does benefit every time someone uses the code. So if you want to help yourself out and help the channel out at the same time, that would be greatly appreciated. Okay, the tip that we're going over in this video is actually a well-known one, but it's something that not a lot of people are taking full advantage of right now. And that is using debuff generals. With a lot of the changes that we've seen in the game, people are aware of debuff generals. The main two debuff generals that we have are Sanada and Cortez. Sanada being the better of the two in my opinion. And in recent times, a lot of people use these monster debuff generals for solo attacking. But prior to that, these monster debuff generals were used during rallies. And that is how most of us started using them. But over time, that has gradually changed and we are using them a lot less now. I can cop to it that even my alliance, we fell victim to that as well. And it's something that I'm trying to gradually bring back because when done right, these monster debuff generals can be very helpful for taking out some of those bigger bosses. So how do you use them? Very simple. Someone starts a boss monster rally with their main monster general. And then other players send the monster debuff generals to the rally. The debuffs that these general have will be applied to the boss monster being attacked. And as far as we understand right now, those debuffs stack up to a certain extent. When done right, the addition of these monster debuff generals into a rally can help you kill bosses that you have a hard time killing or can significantly lower the amount of wounded that you take when killing certain bosses. That has been my experience when using these monster debuff generals. And I'm sure a lot of you might have had similar experiences to that. If you have, please feel free to drop a comment below so we know the kind of experiences that you've had using these monster debuff generals. But with that being said, the thing when using these monster debuff generals is that you can't just send one or two. No, that won't cut it. You need a lot more than that. You need several people in your alliance sending those monster debuff generals to rallies. Ideally, you'd be looking at having over five or six of those things in every rally that you're sending. The more the merrier, obviously. Now, we're going to go over how to set up these monster debuff generals so that you can get the maximum benefit from them. Here, I have my Sanada, and this is the gear setup that I have. Of course, you would want to raise his level as much as you can. 
you'd also want to five star the general. Then for the gear choices, you would want four pieces of dragon gear and two pieces of general's gear. Okay, there's actually a gear type called General's Gear. You want those. Why? Because if you look at the General's Gear here, you have the two-piece set attribute, monster attack minus 5%. You want that. Then, for the Dragon Gear, if you look at the four-piece attribute, it has monster attack and defense, minus 10% each. So that's the debuff that you get for monsters in this gear. Now you can have different combinations of the gear pieces, but I highly recommend that you go with this combination that I have here right now. And I'm gonna explain why. The most important piece that you need to have here is the dragon ring. This is because you want the double drop that you get with this ring. If you're going to be sending these debuff generals to boss monster rallies, you need that double drop. Now, once you fix the ring in there, the combinations that you have become a bit more limited. So that is why I would recommend that you go with dragon gear for the weapon, the chest armor, and the helmet. And then you do the general gear for the boots and for the leg armor. You can't go wrong with this combination. Now, another point to note is that you do not need to five star all the pieces of gear. The only two pieces that you need to five star are the ring and the weapon. The ring, of course, you need to five star so that you can max out that double drop percent that you get there for the weapon and i suggest going with the dragon spear what you want here is none of the other attributes no the other attributes are not very important to you what is important to you here is this one march speed to monsters okay because if you're going to be sending it to rallies you want the speed to be as high as possible so you want the dragon spear and you want this spear five starred aside from that all the other gear pieces you do not need to star now for the books that you have on this general i would recommend getting march speed monster march speed and lock those three books are what i recommend you put on your monster debuff general and then for the cultivation as you would for any rally joining general, you only want to be cultivating leadership, as you can see here, because that influences the speed of the general. Finally, Sanada does have some extra debuffs in his specialty. If we look here, you can see his first specialty, he has monster attack debuff of minus 15%. Now, I wouldn't recommend that you do this simply because specialties are expensive and you will probably have higher priority generals that you are saving up your runestones to do specialties on. But if you could afford to do it, this is an extra debuff that you can get with this general. So once you set your general up like this, you'll be very ready to send him out to join as many rallies as possible. Now, doing this on your main account might be difficult depending on the stage that you're at. If your demand for materials is still very high, you might not be able to spare enough materials to do this on your main account. But if you have family members or accounts that you're taking care of that have a lot of material stashed in there, you can do this and then when they are joining rallies, you send the debuff general along with that. And if you can get as many people in your alliance to do the same and send them to big boss rallies, that should help you guys out a lot. And then when you are sending the general to the rallies, the setup that I recommend that you go with is 
to have the main monster debuff general, which I recommend being Sanada. So you have Sanada as main, you've geared him up as we talked about now, and then you send Cortez as an assistant. In my opinion, that way you get the full benefit of the monster debuff generals. And if there are several of you doing this for big boss monster rallies, you should see the difference. So you and your alliance mates can try this tip out if you haven't done it before. And feel free to drop a comment below so that we know the kind of experiences that you've had testing this out. I hope you enjoyed that tip, guys. Thank you very much. Aka signing out.